Spirit, Blackberry Man, Rising Red Eagle, with a White Eagle Warrior. I have an Eagle Spirit and I'm from the Bear Clan. Why am I who I, I am today? I was struggling finding myself in the world because I didn't know my identity. And I thought, well, what started it? Where did this confusion come from? And the Indian Act, the creation of that thing put our people in positions that we should have never been, ever, that nobody should ever be. Um, it took away so many things, so much culture, so much love, and so much pride in who we are as indigenous people. And that's all we wanted to be, and we were punished for that. My family has suffered from it today. And um, these graves, these mock graves are representative of all the children lost in the residential school system, my family who have been affected by it, and the abuse that they faced, and the abuse that they passed down to their children that I have to deal with. We all suffer in our own ways, and this is my way of showing what I had to do to overcome those things. Um, this tree of life that we call it represents all that hope and prayer that you put into your life, you can put into this tree. Because that tree carries those prayers for you with those tobacco ties. And with those ribbons, represents all people and all walks of life that come through here. Um, I invited all those spirits and all those children and those families that suffered to come here to, to be with us today. Those spirits that needed to be heard they're here with us today. I smoked my pipe for them. I offered my tobacco for them. I prayed for them every day when I started this project until now. I was given a little people pipe. And little people are spirits like children. And they remind us to take it easy, to see things differently, to relax. And that's what children do by nature. I was gifted that pipe and I learned that it came for those children that passed in those schools. I was unsure what to do with that responsibility for a long time because I didn't know who I was as a person yet. Well, now I do. I figured that out. And I turned all of that into what you see on the wall. I turned that negativity into something positive, into something good. And that's what everybody should strive to do in their life. When I turn to my culture, only good things come. Only positivity happens. And I wanted to create a visual image of our people as who we are and what we believe in. That there are things there that we feel and that we actually do. It's not a myth, it's not an artifact. These are things that we believe in. This is a talking stick that we believe in that helps us. All of these references that you see, are things that I just attained through my life. Things that I would see on the side of the road growing up on the reserve. I'd see a tiger living and I'd, I'd pick it up because I appreciated that nature and I drew one. These are all examples of my life and my development as a person. And I only hope that this display and my artwork can help people down in, the, in their life, help them heal in some way, to move on. Because this Tragedy, these things will never leave us. They'll stick with us for the rest of our life. But at least we can acknowledge it and move on. We can step in the right direction. I don't tell people to not step over them. You can walk across if you want. Don't feel bad. Because that's a part of acknowledging what's in front of you. So you can move on. So you can see things clearly and live a happy, wholesome life. That was what we were taught. All of this was what I was taught by my people, by my elders, by my family, 
by those people you see in those photographs over there. Those are my great aunts and uncles and grandparents that suffered from those systems. And they're so beautiful when you look at them. They're so strong. And they worked so hard to be who they were. And I'm doing the best I can to remember that and to carry it on so I can give it to this young man so he can carry that tradition on to his family. So that being said, we're going to sing a song, the bear song, to honor everyone here, to honor this event, and to honor all of us here.